All right. Well, I guess we're going to go into a request topic here. Okay. Um, God damn it. I'm never prepared for this shit. <laughs> I do this every stinking time. All right. <clears throat> so this, uh, we'll go with this one because this kind of ties in with the Survivor Series thing we were talking about. This comes from Fred. Uh, what the fuck happened at Survivor Series? I was watching the event at work. I uh, went to the vending machine to get a wild cherry Pepsi. <laughs> Came back and the main event was over. Is this possibly the most disappointing main event we've seen from WWE ever? Uh, I don't think ever, but it's in the top ten. Yeah, it's up there. It's up there. I'm trying to think of others. I mean... Honestly, the first time I saw Sting and Hogan go at it during that whole, like, you know, The Crow, Sting, and w NWO Sting, uh, oh. Hogan, that was kind of boring because oh. Hogan spent most of the time getting the 10 countdown outside of the ring and then coming back in at the last second. Well, that was WCW, like, though. If he's talking well, I'm just saying wrestling paper. Yeah, if you're, if you're talking wrestling paper, then, oh, my God, Ultimate Warrior against Hulk Hogan in 1996. That when, was such a joke. When they brought it back and nothing went well and nothing worked. And, and there was also another one where Hogan fought Rowdy Piper. That one was awful, too. Uh, no, Fred, I think the worst main event in WWE history was Bam Bam Bigelow against Lawrence Taylor at WrestleMania. Oh my God. <laughs> As that is your main event. It, yeah, it, oh. it might have been it might have been longer than this, what but about the one with Rodman in it. Well, I mean, well, he didn't there was actually some yeah. wrestling in that one. Rodman yeah. kind of just got thrown around. Yeah. Um there are several others that I could think of. I still where's my uh where's my big show Shaq match that? that was supposed to happen it might happen at wrestlemania i don't okay. know it, it might they might build that back up again a lot of people forgot about it. i uh i want it i didn't forget about it <laughs> also uh fred i know that you're like just specifically playing to your taste here uh bret hart getting screwed by Shawn michaels survivor series 97 uh i know you <laughs> you probably weren't too happy about that one um I mean, Shawn been... michaels double crossed somebody <laughs> It's I would have double cross. I would have never have thought. There have been there have been several, but yeah, this one here, like I think it was Cody that said that went over like a wet fart. Like it just <laughs> nobody knew what to think or what to do. And yeah, if you got up and thought, oh, well, I'll come back and watch the rest of it to go get your wild cherry Pepsi or to go to you know get a, a bag of chips from the kitchen or something, you came back and it's over, and you're like, wait, what? <laughs> How can you go from a match that's 52 minutes long to a match that's less than two minutes long? Well, here here was the question I had that I forgot to ask you earlier. When this match started, what time of the night were we at? Like, how much more of the special did we have? Oh, well, like, with most with most pay-per-views, they don't give a set end time to them um, because of it being their network. They can run it as long as they want okay. to. But I, <clears throat> I believe they had given them... I feel like, because I watched it kind of on a slight delay... Because I did pause and come back. Uh -huh. But, like, I would say that it felt like they gave them... It didn't feel like they, it took forever to get to them. It felt like they gave them time, and it just kind of just abruptly ended. Huh. Because I'm just, like, wondering, like, what time the match actually happened. Like, in the evening. Because... It was, like, it was... Ap well... Okay, let's put it this way. When, people, when I started getting texts from people about it, it was around a little after 10. Yeah. So, most of these pay-per-views, from I remember watching them, run to 10, 30, 11 o'clock the rest of the time. Correct. So, this one ended almost an hour earlier. Mm-hmm. Because, I mean, they could have had... It felt like it ended about a half hour earlier than it should have. Yeah. Which is a giant middle finger <laughs> to yeah. anyone paying for this shit. Ah, oh, man. Yeah. No, it's up there is one of the most disappointing. Like I said, I don't know if it really is... And, of course, you know, going back through my mind, I know there's plenty of bad main events I've seen that that I, I might not remember right off the top of my head, but there were a few right there that I definitely remembered. Um, and I still think that Bam Bam Bigelow, God rest his soul, he was not a bad wrestler, but to have him face Lawrence Taylor in a main event, who was on drugs that day? That's all i got to say about that. Everyone.